Folks ask me all the time, how many instruments do you play, Al Simmons? And my answer is always the same. I say, all of them, with the emphasis on play, because I like playing music on, well, you know what? Yes, I do practice a lot with my banjo and my harmonica. They're my favorite instruments, but I also, I enjoy playing all instruments. And I really enjoy playing brass instruments, like a, a, a trumpet, a trombone, a tuba, a sousaphone. And you can make your own brass instrument out of an ordinary tube. This is just a cardboard tube, and you can turn it into a brass instrument just by blowing into it like this. Okay, hang on. Oh, hang on. Oh, I see the problem. There's a whole bunch of people stuck in here. They're watching this video. That's the problem. Too many people. No, this is a resonating chamber with no vibrations. I have to put vibrations into this. I could do it like this, turn it into a percussion instrument or a whistle by blowing across the top or a brass instrument by making my lips do the buzzing like this. My buzzing lips make the entire column of air vibrate. That's what makes the sound. The more air in that column, the lower the note. This is a longer tube. Here's a really long tube. It's called a didgeridoo. It's a musical instrument, even though it sounds like a question. Didgeridoo? Yes, I did. You play it like a brass instrument. This thing was invented 40,000 years ago in Australia. <gasps> it's made out of bamboo, but there's lots of brass instruments that are actually made out of brass. <laughs> amazing that you can make music just by going and attaching it to a hollow tube it's like a, a, a musical miracle They could take that same length of pipe, wrap it around and around and around and have a nice compact unit like this. I built this one out of copper tubing, wear it around my neck so I don't have to hold it with my hands. I call it my hands-free bugle. <laughs> 